Ah, what a beautiful day. The sun is shining, the choir is singing, and the raid boss is getting absolutely destroyed. But these things are more like than you think because the Light Element choir members are actually the ones taking him down. Just who are these people, you ask? Lucretia is a five-star light one from Drugal you lost. The songstress of the century, she comes at quite the cost. She can sing, she can fight. She has a lot of might and for end game content. I think she'll be alright. Her first skill's empowering triplet, cause killing with rainbows is fun. It also has the added effect of energy for everyone. Her second skill, Crescendo Caress, is a very strong self buff. It raises strength and energy by two, and that is more than enough. Her co ability is called Damage for the Team. Her first ability is Strength and Energy. Her resistance to curses might define him well. And Broken Punisher hasn't much to tell. For equipment, this is best. Resounding rendition, no less. Criticals cannot be wrong, so let's add Levens to this song. Her dragon also must be strong, and Cupid's sure to sing along. Finally ready to go, the next teammate is, oh no. Elias is a four-star light bow from the raid event. But please don't get your hopes up, for his stats won't leave a dent. For you see, he is free, so don't go blaming me if he lets the whole team get killed horrendously. His first skill is up tempo chord. Hitting enemies in a line I don't know what bows have to do with song But whatever I guess it is fine His second skill virtuoso anthem Is just energy for the team It's not much but what can I say It really fits the musical theme His go ability is bow skill haste But demon's bane is usually a waste He only reaches 50% cursed res And 5 star less defense is almost useless one prince you should keep in mind For his bonds is quite the find His curse res is lacking and hence I recommend King's countenance Liger is the perfect match Since you can't redeem his stats Finally I'm through with you Now let me begin anew Pixel is a four star light step from the gacha pool The music on my astro His job is pretty cool He can fight, he can heal And your kills he can steal Even though his whole kit of the healing deal His first skill is spirited song To heal and regenerate the group You best hope they know how to dodge Or they're gonna die before we get through His second skill, I to assault Grants energy and potency punch But you better plan so he's not the only staff Or it's not going to do much His core ability is healing potency And he gets more at full HP Sleepers is quite unorthodox but skill prep is sure to help a lot As the healer give him this Healing potency can't miss On the same note you will need The greatest gift for more XP His dragon must match his lore And who better than Unicorn Now there's but one member left Who's this child, what the heck Pia is a 4 star with Lance who is also here A budding vocalist who for some reason wields a spear Her best friend is a mouse she wears a pretty blouse, and for crying out loud, where is her parents' house? Her first skill is called Kaboom, as is to be expected from a child. But given that she's built for HP, the effect may be quite mild. Her second skill is Cheer Up Chums, which is also just energy. But hey, just think it could be worse, at least she isn't free. Her co ability grants more HP, and she gets defense while healthy. Resistance to bog is enough But with the script she won't be using double buff For one prince this is her best chance Dragon and tamer for a lance A mother's love is a great pick For this child with a stick A dragon should look out for her So Karuda is the best for sure I still think she should not be here But now we're out of time I fear and that's all the notable members. I hope everyone had a wonderful Resplendent Refrain rerun, and remember, only you can stop the tragedy of Elias filling a spot on your team.